Now, good morning, Washington, on your side. Coming up in our 6 a.m. hour, a new type of lie detection test, how your eyes can give you away. Well, they say that eyes are the window to the soul, and one technology company believes that your eyes are also the most efficient way to tell if you're lying. Reporter Gabby Hart takes a look at some new technology that its creators say can see right through your lies. A new form of lie detection claims it can see the truth. There are markers in the eyes that um, are able to accurately determine if an individual is being deceptive. Neil Harris is the vice president of Converis, the company that created this new technology called Eye Detect. It uses only the eyes to determine if a person is lying. When uh, a human being is being deceptive, there are these microdilations of the pupils. It's the extra mental energy that it takes to be deceptive. Eye Detect has been in the work since 2003. Only taking 30 minutes to complete, this new testing technology could be faster and more efficient than the old school polygraph. Its creators argue that Eye Detect may have the edge because it isn't influenced by any human bias. So by re removing the human element, we believe we can make the assessment of credibility far more forensic in nature. Ron Slay is a security consultant who administers polygraph exams. He says in his 40 years of experience, he's seen all forms of deception, and he thinks it takes more than a computer system and answering a few questions to detect a lie. You can't automate the human mind. But Slay says it can sometimes be harder to catch the people you want to catch because they have their own truths. They're not really answering your questions at all. They're answering what they perceive to be your questions. Slay and Harris agree that both eye detect and polygraphs can get it wrong sometimes. There will be some false positives and false negatives with eye detect as it exists today. But, but Harris says the beauty of computer algorithms is that they get smarter over time. Still, the polygraph remains a powerful detection tool, not likely to be replaced anytime soon. I think it's the age-old argument of man against the machine. I'm Gabby Hart reporting. How about a blend of the two? That's what yeah, I'm say. Both both of blend of the two. Yeah, yeah. Interesting. Maybe eventually we'll get to that, maybe? Right. Hmm. Okay. I know some people that should invest in some sunglasses then. <laughs> <Yeah. that's> true. <laughs> Let's talk during the break. Just saying. <laughs> do we need the sunshades today? Uh, yes, we do. Okay. But for this morning, no. Okay. This morning we could see.